overall, it seems like it's a lovely love story. It is. Between very much. you and Emilio, because it, now, this sounds. I, are you lying? I'm that not. That he is your only My ever boyfriend. My first and only. Really? Yes, he says I don't know any better, that's why it's good. <laughs> <laughs> and I tell him that I don't have to have hamburger to know I have filet mignon at home. Oh, yes. hamburger's good though. Yes. <laughs> Just for a change. Yeah, you know. Now we're going to be Don't married knock it. 40 years in September. <gasps> Congratulations. Three yes. together. Yes. 40 years. Yes. yes. But it's wonderful. It's a proper two love story, 40 years in September, but there is something, and it, and it does sound annoying, so there is a <laughs> quality in him that does annoy you. Well, it, it doesn't really annoy me. It actually makes me very happy because he makes me laugh all the time. Uh, he's got business neurons in his brain and music and he's focused on all that. But he is the most absent-minded individual you will ever see. He has left me places forgetting that I was with him when he went to get the car. <laughs> Where, and this is before cell phone days, so he goes, no, I don't want you to get wet, it's sprinkling. 45 minutes later, backstage, where is he? I call home. He was there. <laughs> Hello, you you forgot me. Oh, <laughs> I didn't know you were with me. And then he has this other funny thing, like he'll he has a direct connection between his brain and his mouth. He doesn't really edit anything, so whatever pops into his head first. Fortunately, I speak Emilio, so uh, I can usually figure it out. But like things like this, the other day he comes up to me and he goes, "Look, Tom Cruise," as he points to his shoes, and I'm going. Tom Cruise, Tom Cruise. And I was thinking, because Tom Cruise had been at our home, we'd had a, a dinner, and I go, did he give you that as a gift? What, what, what Tom Cruise? He goes, yeah, the designer. I go, Tom Ford. <laughs> <laughs> that kind of thing is constant. You know what he calls one, the queen of soul? Urethra Franklin. <laughs> <laughs> it's more complicated, I don't understand. <laughs> he does crazy things, we're flying out of Vegas, and he goes, look, there it is, Notre Dame. I go. It's Hoover Dam. <laughs> <laughs> this kind of thing, it's like all the time. <laughs> so he keeps me laughing. I think that's why we've been married 40 years.